guest tonight is a very funny guy who's going to be performing next weekend at Charlie Goodnight's in Raleigh, North Carolina. Please welcome Mr. Jake Johansson. <laughs> There, Jake. I am. I am excited to be here. Sad that Andy's leaving. Yes. Although, what great timing! The Gladiator movies are hot now. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> you're the yeah. first person to see through my plan. <laughs> it's, it's like you're a genius. You know? a Step right into that role. Yeah. How are you? You look good. <laughs> I feel pretty good. I've, yeah. I've been. I'm having a little. Uh, I've, I went through a single, you know, time with, uh, which, you know, no girlfriend, and so. That's that's what single means, yeah. Yeah, I know, but uh, it's people are tired at right, this time of right, night. Right. You got to spell it out. I, <laughs> right, right. Um, and so I think I have. Uh, it was like a too much free time situation. So I've come up with some theories about the world and how to make it better. My first plan. See if this sounds right to you. I think as people get older, mm -hmm. they should have to drive smaller and smaller cars. We're going the wrong way with the old people <laughs> getting the bigger and bigger cars. Right. It's so funny you can't even see them in there. They watch out for me. And so <laughs> I, my father now is driving around in a Ford Explorer. A truck. It's like a truck, you know? Big, big car, yeah. So I'm down visiting, and we're making a left-hand turn. We have the green arrow, uh, which turns yellow. So my dad stops in the intersection, and we back out. <laughs> Safety first. Right, and then, right. and now we're waiting for the light to change in reverse mm -hmm. and uh yeah and it's my dad so i can't say anything because no matter what i say you know i'm gonna get the well he's driving a damn car you know i <laughs> i taught you how to drive a damn car I'm, not, you know, so I'm, I'm sitting there trying uh -huh. staring at the thing pointing at the reverse and right. trying to telepathically you know reverse <laughs> <laughs> right right send it to him and uh, finally i realized the only way out of that situation is just wait for us to back into another car mm -hmm. and then uh, try and not make a big deal out of it. Right. So Good I plan. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it saves me a lot of aggravation. Right, right. So my, I feel like he should have to drive smaller and smaller cars till finally he's just wearing hard pants. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> Motorized hard right. pants. Yeah. <laughs> at, at that point, the police step in and take you out of the street. How so, about any, I mean, th this is good, you've had free time, that's not a bad idea. Any other ideas to well, make the world better? I have a plan. Now, this is great in an election year. My, my other ideas are very, uh, you know, I feel like I'm looking at the problems in the world. First of all, the homeless problem. Terrible. Mm -hmm. I, I feel bad. I see the homeless people all the time and I never know what to do. I mean, I give some money to charity. People always say, don't, don't give the homeless people money. Don't give the actual homeless people money, you know, because they'll just spend it on booze or drugs. People say that. I kind of feel like, hey, the guy lives in a box, <laughs> you know. Maybe he could use a drink. <laughs> um, so I, I, I don't have a problem with, right. with them spending it that way. But it's st at the same time, I can't afford to give all of them. A, I can't afford to buy around for the homeless people. Right, right. Um, <laughs> but uh, maybe if I win the lottery or something, that buy might be my belly you know, up to the bar for yeah, everyone. Belly up tonight, we lose. <laughs> um, so I've uh, anyway. My plan is for the homeless, I've combined the homeless problem with the health care crisis. And in my plan, we send the homeless to medical school. <laughs> now, okay, I'm trying to follow here. Now, a doctor is a good job. They've all got good jobs. Mm -hmm. And whenever you need a doctor, you don't have to make an appointment because they're just out walking around. <laughs> you know? You just, you just flag them down and you get a diagnosis. I predict you have a tiny lizard princess trapped in your abdomen. <laughs> and, uh, that's, you're going to want more second opinions. Right, with right. With the homeless doctors, I would have to say. Now, but, now these are good. These, like I say, these are great ideas. There's a presidential election coming up. Have you ever thought of taking any of these ideas? Ideas and, and using them there. Well, I, this is a hot button political issue right now: the illegal immigration. Not not legal immigrants, illegal immigrants. You right. know, it's very controversial. And in California, we're passing all these laws which are hard to enforce. And like I said, controversial. My plan for illegal immigration: very simple. Burning river of gas. <laughs> right? Just. It's a great idea. The whole border, uh -huh. burning river burning of gas. Burning river of gas. <laughs> okay. This is, I think you're on to something here. It's a, it's a, first of all, mm -hmm. 
that's going to create a lot of jobs. That is a big project. <laughs> right. and, uh, Keep that thing going. Right. And, and second of all, right. I think it's going to be a tourist attraction for both countries. <laughs> you know? I, I, I would go down there to see that, would just go, oh, you know? And, uh, every once in a while, somebody trying to run across, ah, you know? And it's, uh, you know, we'll have... Uh, this is good. Hang on to this. We'll, you could sell this. No, we'll have rangers standing by to put people out. Um, maybe we could turn it off and on at random to encourage people to go for it. You, know? you got it. You got it. Oh, oh, oh. I really feel strongly. I about love that. these ideas. I want to somehow get a piece of this. This thank is you. a big money scheme. Uh, thank you very much. First of all, next weekend, of course, as I said, Jake's going to be at Charlie Goodnight's in Raleigh, North Carolina. Jake, every time you come, it's hilarious. Thank you for Always doing it. Jake Johansson, everybody.